Yo, what's up, guys? This is the King of K here. Oh, another K-pop review. Uh, this is going to be a quick one. Um, cause I'm about to step out briefly, but I really want to do this because it. I forgot to do this review when it came out, or this one song came out. But uh, I took a listen to it uh, yesterday. Zion T is back with a new track called "Just" featuring Crush. Somehow that all rhymes. But anyway, um, so my review on a uh, Zion T. Uh, Zion T. Uh, to me, is one of my favorite artists um, in K-pop in quite a while. Uh, he's someone I consider to be a genuine uh, artist. He's been in the game for years. I mean, working behind the scenes. Um, I know uh, I've always considered We Song to be the Korean uh, Neo, which I still do think so. But I can probably put Zion T in the same category. I kind of consider Zion T to also be like the Korean version of Neo, uh, just ar just artistically, his musical style and everything kind of reminds me a little bit of that. But anyway, um, Zion T came out with his first album back in 2013, two years ago. Well, actually, it'd be three years ago now because we're in 2015. Three years ago, he came out with his debut mini album, which I loved. I downloaded it, loved it, thought that was one of the best albums of that year. Um, and so he's back again with another project with Crush again, the song called Just... And uh, I can just say this, I just love the song, Just. Um, the melody, uh, the, uh, uh, Zion, T, Zion T's, um, how should I say, his biggest aspect or attribute, excuse me, uh, is, is making melodies that really soothe you. He makes soothing melodies and melodies that can really match your mood. Um, and that's really hard to do um, as a singer songwriter is finding melodies that can match people's emotions and or moods. That's something that's very hard to do. Trust me. I know. Um, so I really like it. Uh, the song itself is about, you know, breaking up, you know, drifting away. And uh, the, the, the lyrics, I think, are, are, are nice. Uh, I can't really say that for a lot of Korean songs in terms of lyrics, you know, lyrically. But lyrically, I think the song was written well. Uh, it it fits the song. It fit the the the, the scenario or the story of the of the video. Um, Zion T has very cool, smooth vocals. It's just very smooth and just marinates and blends in wonderfully with the melody and the beat and the arrangement of the song. Uh, Crush. Uh, not too much is known about. I mean, Crush is still somewhat kind of new to the K-pop scene. Uh, not too much is known about him, but he is a good uh, singer slash and rapper. Um, I thought the rapping was really nice. Um, I think this is their second collaboration. If I, uh, yeah, this is the second collaboration because the first one was on his first mini album. Anyway, uh, <coughs> uh, uh, Zion T, <coughs> Crush, excuse me, complimented Zion T um, on this track, on this project. Uh, the rap was nice. Um the singing was solid. They really complimented each other. Um, I'm not a big fan on collaborations, uh, even when it comes to music here in the States. I'm not really big on collaborations. Um, very few artists, I think, complement each other when you put them together. Um, Zion T and Crush, this is like their second or third project together. They complement each other very well. Um, <clears throat> I don't know if this I don't know if this is just a single or if Zion T is coming out with a new album. I I heard he was coming out with a new album. I don't know if it's out yet. Maybe this is the first single of his album that's yet to come. I have to do more research on that. But at the end of the day, uh, Zion T, I will call him the king of R&B in Korea. Uh, the, the, the Korean R&B king. Um, or K-pop R&B, whatever you want to call it. Um, I love it. And, uh, you know, re really sitting back and kind of some of the music we've gotten so far. I think it's been really, really good. Uh, in my term, terms of music, I mean, like, not your average, you know, K-pop, poppy song that's hot for, like, you know, a month, and then you forget about it. But, I mean, true, genuine, authentic music from what I consider legit artists, um, like G-Soul a couple of weeks ago, um, and now Zion T. I'm forgetting someone else, but I can't remember right now. Um, even G Dragon, uh, not G Dragon, uh, uh, J Park with this song, Get It Got It Good, GGG. 
yes, that's an American influence kind of song, heavily American influence song. But um, I think Get It Got It Good uh, was another solid track that he released uh, earlier, well, a couple of weeks back as well. Um, so I love it. I love Zion T song. Um, to me, uh, now now with the, the debut of a G Soul, it's like G Soul versus Zion T. That'd be some good competition. I would like. I would pay money to see those two do like a a, a standoff competition or something at a concert or a music show. Something. G Soul versus Zion T. Um, so yeah, you guys, let me know what you think about uh, Zion T's new single, Just What and Just featuring Crush. Uh, I'm your thoughts in the box below. Comment, hit the like button, and do yourself a favor and hit that subscribe button as well. This is King of K-pop. Peace.